Okay, um, let's see how you can change the total size that is allocated to your recycle bin. If you are quite a mismanaged person or if you are too busy to empty up your recycle bin, once you delete your files and you end up with really large recycle bins, you might want to take a look at this. Now, if you want to change the maximum size that is allocated to your recycle bin by default, um, all you have to do is go to recycle bin, right click on it and go to properties. Now over here, um, it says custom size, maximum size in MBs. Now for me, I have just left it by default, whichever it is. So this is approximately 7.5 GB. Uh, it is 7700 MB so approximately 7.5 GB but if you okay I'm sorry just let me minimize this but if you want to change this you can obviously go ahead and change it from here now one thing to notice is that if your recycle bin really uh, goes beyond the size that is allocated to it it might just delete the files automatically or it might throw up some strange errors so I just wanted to kind of warn you before you do this, but obviously if you want to do this, go ahead and do this. So that's just how you can go ahead and allocate custom size. You will notice that if the larger the disk you select for your recycle bin, the larger the size it allocates to recycle bin. So if I selected my 2TB external hard disk, uh, it selects approximately 96 GB to recycle bin. And that's huge. Almost 100 GBs of data just in recycle bin. Wow. Um, by the way, that's almost equivalent to my primary hard disk. I have a SSD, C drive. Okay, so that's it for this particular video, guys. That's how you can change the maximum size that you want to allocate. It's in MBs, megabytes. So put the values accordingly. Um, and thanks a lot for watching this video. Do share this video. Do like this video. Do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. That's going to be a huge motivation for me to create more videos like this. And if you have any queries, any concerns, anything you want to say to me, just write them in, in comments below. Thanks a lot again for watching this video and do stay tuned for more.